Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. Stelz Kavassos here, I'm Anthony. I'm Casey. And today we're watching the second episode of The Promised Neverland. So last episode hurt my feelings. <laughs> um, yeah. Yeah, I was a little intense, did not expect that, but it's kind of making yeah. me excited to see like more, but I'm also scared. Yeah, uh, man, this is a really dark show, or at least dark tone. Um, I was having some thoughts that it was going to go down a dark path, got kind of about like, five minutes into the first episode. I was like, there's mm -hmm. something nefarious here. I mean, the kids having tattoos on their necks of numbers, that doesn't start off well. Mm -hmm. um, so now we know that there is like some sort of like creatures um, in this world. Um, they are eating children. Uh, they are selling children. Um, yeah. It's weird. Um I'm not quite sure how these kids are going to be able to get out. It doesn't seem like there's that many guards up. They they no. walked up on the fence that was like low level. Maybe it seemed like, a like fear? it was more about the fear instilling yeah. it to them. However, their mother mm -hmm. or the person that's watching over them now knows that the teddy bear that mm -hmm. she probably was the one that left that on the table yeah. was found there. So she's going to think that there's the kids that came there. I think she's going to be looking for who that might be. Um, you know, there's two other kids that are scheduled to be adopted. And Ooh. I know, I don't think that we're going to be able to find an escape route before that happens. Yeah. So I feel like Emma, Norman, and Ray are going to be the ones who are going to escape. I feel like this border is kind of like a mental thing. Like, they're just told not to, and no one's ever probably tried to escape before. But then again, I don't really know where this is located like maybe they're around a dangerous area not exactly sure like are these actual orphans are they like born here you know like how does this actually work i guess we'll learn more as we go obviously <laughs> all right well let's go ahead and get into it oh my god oh, no ah, ah! gosh oh the dream but that was so horrific yeah that like, makes me nauseous to think about I hope they break out and like fight the system, you know, <laughs> stick it to the man. Or the creature, yeah. <laughs> whatever that or is. The thing. Hi, Emma. Morning. <laughs> oh, that's difficult for her. Come on, smile. Oh, she was like so full of life. Mm -hmm. Sure, we might have oh. broken the rules by going to the gate last night, but that doesn't mean we saw anything. Smart kid. Based on what the demon said, our ages determine their grades of meat. And if I remember correctly, the siblings who were shipped out before were all between 6 and 12. And the highest quality must be 12 years old. It's our brains. <sighs> that means Not fully that developed. the brain must taste the best. Uh. Following the cycle they've used so far, the next shipment should be at least two months from now. So which exit do we choose for our escape? The gate or the forest? Forest. I'd say the forest. Yeah. Mm-hmm. I feel like there's more places to hide in the forest, too. Yeah. Like, you'd always climb a tree. It's decided. We'll escape during the day through the forest. <gasps> what are you doing? I was gonna say, to like... To look if... over. <gasps> All right. Guess it's up to me. I'm worried what she's gonna see. The wall looks about two or three meters thick. So just keep them in, I guess? Only mom's watching us. So there's no need to be scared. I'm worried about that back. long, Oh, though. shit. Okay, they, they oh, ran back. Oh, good. Is that like a tracker? No need to worry. That has to be a tracker. Oh, no. All right, new plan. Take out Bitch the mom. Mother. Yeah, I know. If you take her out, mm -hmm. then you could take your time. Now that you mention it, mom's always been really good at finding us. So they need to break that thing. Do you think it has to do with the tattoos? Um, is there like something like built into it? Or they have it, like, a chip inside have a chip yeah. inside us. Yep. Smart kid. Yeah. You need to get like Ray. I <laughs> need... <laughs> Watch, this is the, the backstory for L. <laughs> That's what he reminds me of. <laughs> when we tried to deliver a little bunny, it didn't seem like she knew we were there. It just tells you where you're at. So she's looking at it. Mm-hmm. Um... <sighs> What do you say? What's wrong, Emma? You're looking a bit pale. Something happened. I noticed earlier that you weren't your cheery self. What is she doing? She's like trying to see if she'll break. Because if she saw what she thinks she saw. Don't worry about me. Oh, I just okay. got a little sad thinking about how I'm going to have to leave the house pretty soon. I love the house and you oh too. Oh gosh. Choke her out. I wonder what Connie's up to right now. 
You got a little spunk. I know. That she wanted to be a loving mother just like you when she grows up. <laughs> Food's oh. done. Time to wash up. <laughs> right. I love it. About last night. Jesus did you two go yeah. to the gate? No. To no. the gate? I don't know what the hell you're talking but about. That's against the rules. Besides, we were tired from playing tag yesterday. She suspects them. Oh, oh yeah. my poor gosh. baby. How crazy would it be if Ray already pieced this together? Mm-hmm. You know, this is a great idea, Norman. Swiping spare tablecloths. These can be tied up and used as oh, rope. They gotta be careful, though. I feel like it's Ray that's watching, if someone's watching. But what if the mom looks on her thing? I also think Ray would be the least likely to panic. And because he knows a lot, he's good Watch at working Marty with either. machines. He just like walks out from behind a tree. <laughs> he's like, okay. Tell you what, I'll talk to Ray myself. Why don't you head back to the house for now? Why not now? <laughs> oh! 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 <laughs> Yo. This kid. <laughs> he does remind me of Elle. <laughs> Tell me what happened at the gate the other night. Uh -huh. um, you know, when you tried to take little Bunny to Connie, you both were acting a lot weirder than usual. Don't check your watch, don't. I know, uh, please don't check. Oh, no, no, no. Mom is the enemy. <laughs> this is bad. He catches on fast! <laughs> so that means this whole time, Mom's been taking care of us and feeding us so well, so we can get shipped out and become demon food. Actually, I'm surprised you're ready to believe this so easily. Huh? Of course I believe it. Norman would never make up such an unbelievably dumb lie. If we're really going to make a break for it, we need to address a couple things. We should narrow it down to those who can make it. Wait! Aww. We're leaving here and taking everyone. And to make that happen, we need you. He's logistics. There are 37 kids here. Uh, no, there's no way you're going to be able to... There's mom, demons, homing beacons. Killer. Those factors take a oh. bad situation and make it worse. Can you cut it out of yourself? They don't know where it's at. There's no way they could even figure it out. What waits outside is a demon's world. There is no place for humans to live. It was never meant for our kind. Oh, I never even thought about that. But that's true. We take everyone, then we'll all die out there. We leave them behind. But then again... You could just be in a, like, a where specific did you come area. From? Yeah. If there isn't a place out there for humans to live, we'll carve one out for ourselves. Together we'll change the world. Don't let feelings cloud your vision. We'll die. I want to build a boat out of mud as well. <laughs> what gives, huh? Because of Emma. I just want them to get closer so that, like, mm -hmm. the damn mom doesn't check the damn watch. <gasps> Run. Uh, hey guys, shouldn't we still have some free time left? Uh-oh. She checked. Attention. I want you to meet Carol, your newest sibling. And this is Sister Krona. She's here to help me with my duties. Oh, shit. There's two of them now. I'll be living here with all of you from now on. It's nice to meet you. Bitch. <laughs> Ray's like, now we have two people to kill. I'm glad that we brought Ray into the fold, even though mm -hmm. Ray kind of was already spying and kind yeah. of piecing things together. Uh, I'm glad that he believes Norman. He reminds me of a little bit of a baby L, where in that case, I guess Norman could be mellow. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Um, I think they, like, these three, they have different personalities, but they, like, balance each other out, and they're mm. gonna need the different sides, you know, to get through this. I don't know how the heck they're gonna take all these kids out. I mean, obviously, I don't want them to leave any kids behind. And now there's, like, a little baby. You know yeah. how hard it is to have a baby? And especially if you're a kid to take care of all these kids, especially if they're under six. And they're That's not going to be able hard. to comprehend what's going on yeah. either. They're going to get scared mm -hmm. if you told them. So you're almost going to have to kind of... You know, I don't want to say they're going to have to lie to them. But you almost kind of have to for the younger ones. Because yeah. they would just become so hysterical. And you can't really understand. give them a part of the plan. You yeah. almost kind of like got to do the plan around them, in my opinion, and then just bring them on when you formulate the plan. Two months, though. Like, that's what their, yeah. their timeline looks like. Now they have to deal with another person that their mom brought in who's going to be watching them, yeah, I'm like assuming. Yeah, another mom. Um, oh, probably so, because the mom was originally suspicious. And I bet she watched. She looked at the watch when they saw. were there and saw. Yeah. Yeah. And now they're probably going to have two watches. Mm -hmm. Nervous. I think they should kill him. <laughs> Kill them, and then you can just take your time formulating the plan. She probably has to check up with like the demons yeah, in a certain I'm sure time period. Yeah, somebody like checks in or something. I don't know how deep this goes. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Well, we'll see you next time. Bye, everyone.